Hello my soccer universe and welcome to a meanwhile rare collection video. However, I have shot an entire league uh, jersey review, but I did not get the time to edit the first video and since I wanted to put something out, I said, okay, let's look at league uh, jerseys. Who's, which league uh, jerseys did I not cover and what's the oldest one? Turns out to be this beautiful PSG away jersey from the 1927 season. It's actually not the away, it's the third jersey uh, that was specially released uh, back then. Um, it is a jersey that does not feature in the jersey review, so I think that makes it kind of nice and fitting. I gotta say, the moment I saw this one, yes, my first thought is, this looks a little bit like Lyon, but then looking a little bit through the jersey his, his history, this was uh, in the early 90s, this was more or less the classic, this was a PSG home jersey, and I have to say it's a really, really nice look, but I do prefer it not as much as the HDR look. I also think there was a, another uh, early 90s or maybe late 80s shirt that I liked even better, which was the one that had instead of the to the double stripe here, it had the uh, the Eiffel Tower, which I thought was just a gorgeous, gorgeous detail overall. However, this was a shirt that very quickly entered the list of top shirts. I think in my shirts of 2019, it definitely made the top 10 there. And I remember I got it at a local sports store on sale in 2020 together with the Real Madrid away jersey from that season uh, for, I think it was around 40. And I said at that time, okay, I just gotta get it because uh, it's a jersey that I will regret not getting. So I would say while it's hanging back there, it's probably nice to look at a, a little more detail. So I'll get it a little bit more up front and let's see a little bit more. Again, this is the um, stadium version, so this is not the player version. Um, the one thing, the design is really, really nice. The one thing that I have, have said a little bit, I find counterintuitive, is the diagonal shadow striping because there's so much verticality and then you have this diagonality in there where it actually says Paris as well, which is in a way a nice, nice touch. And I, it bugged me until I saw that actually the jersey that this is based off had the exact the exact same shadow pattern in there. I'm not sure if it had Paris written in there. What I do like a whole lot is the All Accord sponsor. It's actually a really nice sponsor and what I like even better, look at how the letters are outlined in white so you don't have to break the stripe which makes the shirt instantly better. I really like the color on this, on this one. It has a functional button color with two buttons here. Maybe this could be a little bit wider, but I think it looks quite stylish. Uh, overall, um, it's still a blank. It was worn. Or I, I, I thought, what will would be play? I mean, yes, you could put a Neymar Mbappé on, on there if I wanted to. However, this was the jersey that uh, Chupa Moting scored the winner against Atalanta in the quarterfinal of the Champions League. Remember that 2-2 two -two tournament uh, played in Lisbon? Um, of course, it's, uh, uh, the crest is uh, sturdy. It is was my first jer uh, jersey with the original Nike logo, which I think was a really nice uh, touch. This was baby, basically the big selling point of these jerseys. Uh, you have here the tag and a little French flag, which PSG shirts uh, tend to have there. As I said, blank on on the back, but it's a really nice. Uh, it's a really nice and actually very comfortable shirt to wear. Uh, always enjoy wearing this one and it's a true highlight in my PSG collection. One that I've not been using a lot in my videos, but I have been wearing because it looks class. Personally, I probably would have preferred it even without sponsor because then, uh, you know, makes it look even better. I also think that the players didn't have all a core, but I think that all a core live limitless, um, a, a much longer sponsor. I have to say the all a core looks overall better. Let me know what you think about this beautiful PSG jersey. Um, it is probably after the 95, 96 home, my favorite PSG jer uh, jersey in my collection, I gotta say. In any case, give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video, subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos like this. I will talk to you soon. Bye!
Hey there, I really hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, here are some videos and playlists that you might enjoy too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the little bell icon so you get notified whenever something happens in my soccer universe. And with that, have a wonderful day. Bye!